fitness side. 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 Hi guys, this is Izzy from Mighty Fit Health Studios. I'm here today to run through a quick program with you, how to train on the beach. This exercise we're gonna do now is, called, is a press up, but it's isolating each pec muscle individually. So when you're in the gym and you're isolating doing single arm chest presses, this is the equivalent to that in a press up style. Make sure your core's tight. When you're bringing your arms to the side, your feet stay still. Keep the hips up as well. All the chest, squeeze the chest as you push down. Make sure you're going all the way to the floor and then back up. Breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth as usual. Exercise I'm gonna do now, guys, work in your ab region called hill climbers. As well as your ab region, it's a bit of cardio, a bit of high intensity dynamic movements. It's really gonna get you sweating and it's gonna get you pumped at the same time. When doing this exercise, guys, make sure there's minimal movement at the hips. Just bring the knees in and out to the chest. Again, keeping the core nice and tight, not bouncing that bum too much. Hands firm on the floor. Use the sand to your advantage. Dig your feet in, in, out, in, out. Next exercise we're gonna do, guys, is box jumps. Working all the leg muscles. For the girls and boys, perfect exercise. It's a plyometric exercise, so you're gonna keep moving. Really dynamic at the same time. Cardio as well. As you can see, guys, very hard exercise. You're sweating already. Of course, the sun don't help. With that exercise, make sure you're getting down low. Landing low each time. You don't want no big pressure on your knees. Big jumps. Choose a height that's adaptable to you. Ways you can regress it as well. Step down rather than keep the jumps and try to progress yourself as you're doing the exercise as well. Next exercise guys, is focus, focusing on the core. There's two exercises put together made into one. We're gonna go from a plank into a side plank. So rather than just sitting still in the sun, we're gonna still move as we're working our core as well. When doing this exercise guys, make sure you keep it slow, control with your rotations, because your rotations are working your obliques slightly as well. Mainly core based exercise, very good exercise to get them abs, them abs strengthened and strengthen that lower back as well if you've got any back pains. Alright guys, next exercise we're going to use the C, reason being to add a little resistance to the exercise. As you can see we're not in a gym, so we're in a beach so we adapt to what's around us. So what it is, it's called high knees, we're going to be on the spot, bringing our knees up, keeping the abs nice and tight, so the water's gonna add that resistance as you're bringing the knees up, and at the same time, it's gonna pull you down so you can finish the workout efficiently. Great exercise, guys. See, heart rate's coming up, breathing heavy now. So make sure you're bringing the knees, the knees nice and high, back straight, keeping arms pumping, arms pumping. Make sure you're using that cardiovascular system, get it going, get the blood flowing all around the muscle. Our right, next exercise, guys, is gonna work your shoulders and your core. Your core mainly, but as we're gonna use the water again, it's gonna work your shoulders that bit more as you're gonna be abducting from the body, so you're gonna work the lateral part of the shoulders. With that exercise, guys, make sure you're bringing one foot out one arm out at the same time. Keep that core tight, don't let the hips drop too much or pump too high, so you're getting a full workout of your cores. Keep the arms under your shoulders, deep breath in, in for the nose, out for the mouth. Another thing, make sure you keep hydrated. As you can see, it's hot out here, so you need to be drinking a lot of fluids as you're doing this workout, okay? Very good exercise, guys. Getting that pump now, in the shoulders, in the chest, all in the upper body, legs are feeling strong. At the closing stages of the workout now, so I need to work that extra hard so I finish strong and I'm ready to just lay down in the beach and relax. Next exercise guys, burpees. Big cardio exercise, big dynamic exercise, big ab exercise. It's gonna work everything for you guys. Again, we're gonna do it in the water to cool you down and again, to add that resistance and to make it fun at the same time. You don't wanna be in the heat too long, just sweating buckets, you're on holiday, you wanna have fun. Great exercise guys. Really working the stomach, cardio, really stripping down, getting you that ripped look, getting you that tongue look with your guy, your girl, this program will be perfect for you. In the water as well, so you're cooling off, you're not baking in the sun. Teaching points, don't bounce the hips, drive the legs as much as you can back.
then back in. Keep it smooth, keep a good rhythm in and out. Don't stop, don't pause. Keep it between about 15 reps. Next exercise, guys, is a big one. It's working a lot of muscles together. Big compound movement that's going to strip away that fat, okay? You're going to be in a static squat position in the water. You're going to go slightly deeper. At the same time, in that static squat position, you're going to be pushing the arms forward, really working them arms and them triceps at the same time, okay? What are you going to find with that exercise, guys? The water's going to try to push you up. It's important to stay nice and low. Really pump them arms the deep you go, the more resistance you're going to get as well. So keep them arms nice and low under the water. Keep pushing, keep pushing, working the back of the arms and that chest again, as well as the legs from being in that static squat position. Next exercise, guys, is a big exercise working a lot of muscles. It's three exercises put together. We're going to do a press up, sit up. Also, with a sit up, we're going to do a rotation. A lot of different movements, a lot of different muscles, exactly what you want. And you want to strip down, get that beach body, get that ripped look, and get that tone look as well. Like I said, guys, big exercise working your obliques, working your abs, working your chest, working your legs. Really dynamic, really getting the heart rate up. Exactly what you need with a full program like this. Next exercise, guys, as cheesy as it is, running in the water. Big exercise for the legs. You're really going to be using them quads going against heavy resistance. The equivalent of doing that, a leg extension or a leg press, it's exactly what it is. You're really running at the same time, like an incline run at the same time. Really good exercise, guys. It's exactly like doing incline runs. Really feel the legs burning after that. Make sure you're pumping them arms. Use everything you can. Sprint to one side, touch the floor. Sprint to the other side, touch the floor. Extra bit of movement, extra bit of rotation, working them obliques as well. All right, guys, that's the core workout done. The main part of it, now we're gonna move on to the cool down. Just simply get in the sea, go for a swim, enjoy the swim, whether you want a breaststroke, freestyle, do what you gotta do. Extra bit of cardio as well as cooling down and just getting in the sea and enjoying your holiday. For me and everyone at Mighty Fit Health Studios, guys, enjoy the rest of your holiday, enjoy the sun, enjoy the beach. We get back to the UK, back to hard work, commitment, training hard, getting your nutrition right, making sure you're getting the best out of life. Enjoy your holiday, guys.